on everyone and welcome back to The Breakdown. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to update to Minecraft 1.14.2. This is going to be a step-by-step -step tutorial. We're going to go over everything you need to know about updating to 1.14.2 from downloading Minecraft Launcher itself to updating in-game. I'm even going to show you that if, let's say, it's four years from now and you want to play on 1.14.2, I can show you exactly how to do that. But nevertheless, first and foremost, we have a message from our sponsor, which is Apex Minecraft Hosting. Go to the first link down below, the breakdown.xyz slash Apex to get an incredible 24 our DDoS protected Minecraft server for you and your friends. We actually love Apex so much that we host our own server on them, play.breakdowncraft.com. So if you're looking for an incredible Minecraft server host, Apex Minecraft Hosting is the way to go. They have 1.14.2 servers up and ready to go for you at any time. You can add plugins to your server. You can even host modded servers over there with just one click with over 50 mod packs ready to install. Nevertheless, you can check out Apex at the first link down below at the breakdown.xyz slash Apex for an incredible Minecraft server. So first and foremost, when you're updating to a new Minecraft version is you need to make sure you have the Minecraft launcher downloaded. Now, if you have this right here, you have it downloaded, right? If you have this on your computer, you have it downloaded. If you don't, you need to download it, and you can do that from the second link down below. That will take you to this page and start a tutorial on how to install the Minecraft launcher. It walks through every single step, including logging in. Now, you do need to own Minecraft. You do need to have bought Minecraft in the past and, and own a Minecraft account in order for this to work, and you can do that by clicking right here. Nevertheless, once you've got the Minecraft launcher open here, updating to 114 is pretty easy. Now, if it's the newest version, all you have to do is click the little green arrow next to the play button, and then click on latest release, and then it will play 114.2. However, what if it isn't? And I'm gonna assume that that's the case, that you need to add 114.2 to your launcher. To do that, click in the top right, these three little lines up here, and then click on launch options. In here, you wanna click on add new, and then we can name this whatever we want. I'm gonna name it play.breakdown craft.com. Why am I doing that? Because that is the best Minecraft server in the multiverse. It's actually our own Minecraft server. We have incredible grief protected survival, two survival servers, one with player economy, one with server based economy, basically slash shop, whereas one is more player shop and jobs based and all that stuff. Both are grief protected. And on top of that, we have an incredible custom skyblock server with over 100 players every single weekend. So come play with us. Play.breakdowncraft.com. Incredible survival, incredible skyblock, and an incredible server. Nevertheless, once we've got that named here, we want to click on version right here. This version drop down. Now, most likely, you're going to have to scroll down all the way down here, and then you'll find the version depending on when you're installing this. However, just look in here for release 1.14.2. See that? Release 1.14.2. Click on that. And then now I'm going to change my resolution. You can do that if you want. It's not required. If you play full screen, you definitely don't need to do it. But I'm just doing it so once we're in game, you can see. Then you can click that save button. Do you see that? That little save button, green save button there. Click on that. And then we can come back over to the news tab the little green arrow next to the play button, and then click on the profile we created, in my case, play.breakdowncraft.com, and click play. Now Minecraft 1.14.2 will download and open up. It's that simple, it's that easy to get things up and running. Mojang has made this a lot easier over time. It used to be a lot more difficult to play older versions, but with the newer Minecraft launcher and everything, it's all pretty simple to go in and create a new profile with any version you want. For example, if you didn't want 1.14.2, you wanted 1.13.2, if you wanted 1.12.2, if you wanted 1.7.10 Minecraft, you could do that using that method there. Nevertheless, once we're in here, you can see this is Minecraft 1.14.2 down here, and that's pretty much that. There's not really any way for me to show you that it's 1.14.2 over 1.14.1 because, well, all that was changed in this update is bug fixes that are sometimes hard to replicate. So, nevertheless, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more awesome content exactly like this. For example, we have an incredible video on starting Minecraft server, which you can check out the eye at the top of your screen. My name is Nick. This has been The Breakdown. Thank you so much for watching, and I am out. Peace.